Ryan, what was this week like for you? Um, it was like any other week, uh, just preparing, trying to make the most of the reps that I got and everything like that. Ryan, even Coach Durkin pointed out just how tough the situation is to come in, obviously, um, started you know, down the depth chart to start the year, and now mm -hmm. coming in against one of the best defenses in college football. Uh, just what were your thoughts coming into the game, being in that spot, and how do you think you, know, you reacted to it? Well, my dad always told me uh, growing up, um, and especially going through this, going throughout the year, being in the position that I was, he used to always tell me, uh, if you have to get, if you stay ready, you don't have to get ready. So um, just preparing like I'm the starter, preparing like it's my team, uh, really just trying to win every rep and trying to take advantage of every situation I get. That's just kind of how I thought about it. Thought about it. Right. But just how much bad luck Maryland's had with quarterbacks. Did that also help you mentally just get prepared, knowing that hey, you know that this might become. Your, your chance at some point just with all the injuries? No, nah, that's that's not something that I think about. Um, you don't wish bad on anybody. You don't think about the run, something bad happening to, to your boys out there. So, like I said, just preparing. Like, I would be the starter. Just for, You never know when your name's going to get called, and you just treat every situation like that. But I don't think Maryland's situation made me think about it any more or less. How and difficult then, yeah. was it for you when you got down 28 nothing? second quarter was half over? Um, really, I just saw it as taking a play at a time, taking a drive at a time. Um, you try not to think about the scoreboard too much because then you start to force things and make bad decisions. So uh, I try to just keep that in the back of my mind. I, obviously, I knew the situation that we were in, but I tried not to put too much thought into it. Was there any in extra incentive because it was Michigan, and your you know, home state school, or was there enough incentive being your first college start? I would be crazy if I said I didn't feel some type of way about it being in Michigan, uh, living about 45 minutes away from there. But uh, it's any other team. It's a good team, any other team. And really, uh, if I made it any more than that, then I wouldn't be, it wouldn't be fair to the rest of the teammates. It wouldn't be fair to myself, and I probably wouldn't prepare as treat treat like another game. Did you, grow up, did you grow up a Michigan fan? Uh, I grew up in Michigan State. Man. Okay, so there was actually even more incentive. <laughs> <laughs> I guess you could say that, yeah. First impressions of your outing, what did you like about this afternoon, how things went for you? Uh, I think I think we fought hard all throughout the game. Uh, obviously, I won some plays back. We won some plays back. But as an overall outing, I think the offensive line did a hell of a job. I think the skilled players did a great job. Uh, too bad we couldn't come out with the dub. We couldn't score points, but. Terp Talk is brought to you by Viner Consulting. Help us support for your computers and networks. Managed services and 24-hour-a-day help desk are just a few of the affordable benefits. Get help when you need it by Terps that you know. Call us at 301-251-2900 or visit oneviner.com. The interception at the end of the first half. What was the play? What was the? What did you see? What developed in front of you? Um, credit to the corner uh, for uh, Michigan. He lulled. He lulled off on the receiver. Um, I was just going up and giving Taven a chance, and unfortunately, he came down with it. He made a great play coming off on the route and driving out in the corner. What happened on the on the? The flea flicker uh, pass. Were you trying to make? Were you starting to run before you had the ball, or? I actually didn't start running enough. I didn't start running fast enough, and I tried to play catch up to the ball. Unfortunately, that's another one of those plays that we wish we could have back. But how, how many how many yards in front did you see? Nobody. I mean, you, there were like three of your oh, guys. I was just focused on the ball. Okay. I saw the ball in, there. Okay. in the right. second. Being the country's second-rated defense. What did Walt do this week? Just to like. I guess not make this too big of a thing for you and to kind of calm you. One of my favorite things about uh, Coach Bell is that he, no matter who the opponent is, he treats them like the same. We prepare the same. We treat every single team like they're the national champion. So we take it very serious throughout the week. And I think he did a great job in preparing us for this game. In the second half, you, know, you started running off of the read option. Is it Did the game slow down for you? Or what did you see that was different than the first half? I think. Uh, as a whole, just play calls. We started, we started to understand what they were doing, and then just letting the game come to me. What was the difference between last week? Obviously, was it was it the opponent, the situation, or or just a combination of both? Between the way you 
played in the fourth quarter against Rutgers and then the way you at least started today? Was it just different, you know, better team, much bigger circumstance that you're starting? Um, two completely different teams, but two good teams as a whole. I really wouldn't say that uh, it affected my mindset or the way I played or anything like that. When did you find out that you were like officially going to be the starter today? Uh, Friday morning. How did had, had that happen? I mean, Pardon was me? it a phone call? Was it to call you in the uh, office? It was, it, was, it was in meetings. Mm-hmm. It was in the QV meetings. And Coach Bell discussed it. Mm-hmm. How cool is it playing with your brother? Oh, it's, I'm living a dream every day playing with him. Because you don't even know. I can make your hands clap.